You turn into the worst of me Held on to every broken spot I wish I never told you why I feel so close to us Your hands still stay in colored dust I've shot from all your broken eyes Still wish I never told you why I Hi guys welcome again to my youtube channel as promised today i'm going to the university of regina to have a tour for you i'm going to try to show you guys pretty much everywhere that you would be accessing as a student when you land okay so i have someone that will be showing us around and i also have someone to take us there okay so get a popcorn get snacks get anything that's gonna make you comfortable as you watch this video yeah let's go Said you would try to lie you was Guess it's said about try and lie for me Is it better that you hurt than I? Cause the weather in the time I slam my world Was there ever any wasted time to be? But is this So this is the school hostel. This is a uh, schoolhouse and you are home. Okay. So you are home for first year. First year housing experience. So I think it's for only 100 level. It's a college on its own, Abby. University. I don't think many international students attend it, but it's for indigenous students. Yeah. But it's very close to the University of Regina. Mm. And it's big as well. Yeah. guys it's actually not easy trying to move around to get videos of places for you because like i said i've not really been here before but right ahead of me is the innovation place i'll show you guys very well now so it was so windy that you could barely hear what i was saying but um what i was just trying to say here is this is the innovation place where all research and development of different innovative ideas have been taking place and i was just telling my videographer to show you the bus stand that's where we usually stay just before picking the bus so instead of you being outside in the sun or in the rain or in the cold and we have it at different stations every different bus stations in canada So this is the side of the building it's just as beautiful as the front view <laughs> then the second side over there is a the technology area where just the same job as this first building they have all their technology research and whatever innovative ideas they are consumed so we we'll call that a big lab and we also have it at the university of saskatchewan as well in my opinion bigger <laughs> 
for those that have never seen our boss before this is what it looks like It is. Oh, it's the like the main place that will now locate you to different places. I'll show you. Oh, okay. Let's go. So when we go in there, oh, this is like our classroom. So I noticed that I unconsciously, in different scenarios, compared the University of Regina to University of Saskatchewan. So you might be wondering why. I originally attend the University of Saskatchewan, but I moved to Regina and I currently take my classes in the University of Regina Annex campus, not this particular campus. So I just had a friend take me around the main campus where most of you will be attending. So if you want to catch up on why I moved to Regina, then please go through my previous videos and you'll be able to understand better. Keep watching. This is the Rideau Center. If we go in there, we are able to access different places in the school, like the library and so many restaurants. Let's go. So this is U of R Student Union area. This is where you get different food. For example, this one is Tim Hortons. That one is Grill and Co. I hope you guys can see. <laughs> if you can sit down, have your food just with your friends while you eat different flags and i don't know if i've ever told you guys but saskatchewan has a rough rider team we call it sask rough riders so that is it there guys i've never seen a patriotic team as this before like basically when it's the rough riders day everybody on the street typically wears the jersey there's also an atm for you that you can use within the school So I just saw this place now and so this area is the film department and I guess this place is where they do all the film production, post-production studio, whatever. It's closed for the weekend but yeah, this place is where they have the studio. This is a Eurogina's jersey. I don't know what they play but this are some of the... Um, what they call it now? The gift items that you get. I forgot what they call that thing, but yeah.
while I was coming down to this particular area, there was a guy playing the piano and I showed you guys. Oh, there's another person now. Literally another person. Is it the same one? Oh, okay, it's the same one. So the guy is still there. <laughs> As an international student, when you come over to this school, the first place you go to is this place, which is the International Enrollment Services. And they are closed for today because, of course, today is weekend, like it's the weekend. But yeah, you come over here, do all of your enrollments, and maybe ask questions. Yeah, so these guys are the ones that are in charge of international students here. And what else? See? So in the U of S, what we call it is the ISAT. Also, we have another ATM for you to use just right after the U of R enrollment services area. Faculty of Arts, Department of History, English Department. See like the beautiful view that it shows. So fall is here. That's why the leaves are changing from green to whatever color it can see. The beautiful thing about these chairs are they are positioned in different sections of the library shelves and you can sit down, have a good view from the outside whilst reading and probably be able to assimilate better. <laughs> fun fact about me i am so scared of heights so if you see me trying to support myself is because i can't just imagine myself looking down <laughs> so funny i decided to turn it into a dance <laughs> that's me trying to overcome my fear so just as i earlier mentioned you can see the chair and then a s smaller stool for you to support your leg if you look straight down you can see a lady sitting down on her chair and supporting her leg looking outside oh my god is the view for me i love love the view lest i forget this is the first floor and we had to take the elevator upstairs you know to see the other library section where we have the shelves and this was me trying to sign out of the library area <laughs> this area is the lobby for students so you can access it by going down this way and see you can have conversations with you and your friends sit down talk so it's just it's the same thing across board here and it's so nice and the enrollment area where you you know talk about admission student recruitment like whenever i tell you guys that you can get student teaching assistant jobs student awards and financial aid you can always do everything here as well
Here is the Faculty of Art School of Journalism. So I've shown you guys this building before, but just to reiterate it, this is the school hostel for maybe one of the school hostels because I don't know if they have more than this, but it's just right beside the building that I came out from. And it's so big. Let me see if I can go around to show you guys more. You guys don't be deceived by this sun that you are seeing behind me or I are seeing flashing in my face. The wind is not a joke. <laughs> okay, I hope that I've been able to make a nice video for you. You guys have seen pretty much everything that I need to show you. People are looking at me and laughing. <laughs> okay, yeah, um I'll try to take a picture very close to the University of Regina logo so that I can have a thumbnail and I'll catch you guys outside. Ooh. Sunny day in it. I am back home now and I hope that you guys enjoyed this video that we made for you. I'm saying we because like I said at the beginning I had someone take me down and I also had another person show me around. So yeah, thank you so much to the two amazing people that took me to the school. Thank you guys so much. And I hope that you guys enjoyed this video because all the views were... And it is safe to say that um, University of Regina is smaller compared to the University of Saskatchewan. But I mean, that's not an argument because we all know that University of Regina is like a younger sister to <laughs> University of Saskatchewan. Um, but overall it was okay and I really enjoyed the ride. The weather was not too cold but it was windy and the sun was out to complement it so that was okay. <laughs> but my legs hurt so bad and I have so many short clips here and there so editing is not going to be fun but I will try to make sure that you see this video by next week or the week after. So yeah, um, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. See, don't even forget to like. You have to like this video. <laughs> Yeah, like this video, subscribe, share, tell a friend to tell a friend, and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye, guys.